The country's biggest right-wing party, Golden Dawn, is back in the news. Its leader is sitting in a jail, suspected of running a criminal organization. As Francis Savaggio reports, his arrest comes after the death of a left-wing artist. Depending on who you ask, Golden Dawn is either Greece's third most popular political party or one of the country's most dangerous criminal organizations. Just days after a nationwide sting, two of the party's elected officials scuffled with reporters as they left an Athens jail. We won't step back, they said. We'll continue until the very end. Two other Greek lawmakers were also arrested as police nabbed 22 party members following the murder of a left-wing rapper last month. It was something that should have happened a long time ago, even before these uh, uh, thugs got into the, into the parliament. Golden Dawn came out of nowhere to win 18 seats in Greece's last election amidst public frustration over traditional party corruption and a national economic crisis. Critics say the party is little more than an anti-immigration neo-Nazi group, but citizens appear pessimistic the current government is capable of stopping the group. This man questions whether the legal system works at all, saying it's a disappointment, nothing more. There is an element of extreme right-wing uh, support throughout Europe, you know, Le Pen in France and other similar organizations. That's always existed. This expert says authorities in Greece were finally forced to act. I think exposing them for what they are is going to wake up a lot of people in Greece who support them, and I think they're going to switch their support to the more conservative parties, the more legitimate parties in Greece. The party's leader, along with several other members, remain behind bars awaiting trial. Those released say Golden Dawn forever and call charges of belonging to a criminal organization unfounded and the arrests unconstitutional. Francis Silvaggio, Global News.